relating to the um, collection of the 13 million euros uh, that was uh, outstanding from the, um, from the non-collection the, la the, 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 the last quarter. Now, I had raised this issue uh, in relation to the contract that I felt that apart from the sale of the entire waste, that this contract to collect the debt was a separate contract under EU legislation and that should have been put out to on a procurement process or a contractual process. I don't believe that, that that has actually happened. I think there's a very serious issue here. On top of that also was the issue that was raised not too long ago uh, by Councillor Fitzpatrick in relation to what uh, uh, Graham were paid to remove the waste from flat complexes, which is also part of the, the agreement. And while I don't want to kind of breach any confidentiality or, or commercially sensitive information, I think it's here now and we need to understand this. When at the last finance SPC meeting, there was a document placed before that SPC meeting, which I was there, which indicated that Greyhound have now franchised out this contract to collect this debt to a Cork company. So what I want to know is, is that where are the arrangements for all of that situation? Who's written off this money and said that we can't actually, want, it's unlikely that we'll actually get it? How much did Greyhound actually give themselves an administrative fee? How much is the organisation that Greyhound has engaged to collect this debt, since they couldn't get it themselves, is getting? How much of the €2 million Euros that was collected do we get? And what is the outcome of that situation? Are we going to turn around and write it off entirely and say that that's it, so we can write out to all these people? But my concerns would be, and it's no disrespect to any of the executives in terms of the, of, of the, of the, of the arrangements that were made with Greyhound, but I would be gravely alarmed that a company that's completely taken over the waste management would also take over. It doesn't make sense. It, it doesn't make sense. Not only does it not make sense, but then that company then franchises it out to a cork company. So there's arrangements in there that concerns us, and the reasons why they concern us is because it actually is our money. Be it owed to us or whatever, it is our money. So I'm not satisfied here, Lord Mayor, and I think we need a special report in relation to this particular matter so as we can ask ourselves, what was it not possible for us to collect this debt? For instance, we have to collect 21 million euros of outstanding rents. We're not going to franchise that out now to a company, are we? We're not going to give that to the Paul or to, or to uh, Simon community to say, listen, lads, you can pick that up for us. So we need to answer some questions here which are really important. Thank you very much. Uh, Councillor Jackson Flanagan.